Hi guys, welcome to my channel, I'm Melanie and I do food hauls and other bits and pieces. So this is part two of my weekly food haul. This is probably a couple of hours after I filmed the last one. Um, there's some stuff in the fridge, I'm actually going to go to the fridge, I'm not editing the video so I'm just going to do the best I can. I just don't have the mental or physical energy to get everything out of the fridge. I know there's not a lot but I just don't have the energy all the time to be honest so I'm going to show you what I've got out that was already out so I saw this I mean you've already seen that in the Polish se Polish section it looks like English mustard it probably isn't there was one that looked like whole grain mustard and it said it was 60p so I thought oh that's good um it'll go down really well not with me and you can keep the glass if you want to they might not want to it was two pounds. Sorry. I'm saying sorry to the dog because literally she stood right behind me and I moved backwards and she's literally there. Um, so I picked it up. It's quite a big jam. It's 250 grams, but it was two pounds. If I would have known it was two pounds, I wouldn't have bothered because they've got mustard in. So be careful what you pick up. There's been times when I pick stuff up and I've read the label twice and it's literally said it's that well not that but whatever item it was and it's come out more expensive it's funny this is the cheapest salt they do other than the Asda zone and then the Asda price one so that's why I got this I rarely ever buy soap I use body washes like shower gels that sort of thing I rarely ever get soap but I always have a bar of soap because sometimes I'll like quickly wash at the sink um, and the salt lasts me forever and I wanted to get like either purrs or dove I used to get purrs all the time that was the salt that if I ever got salt that's what I'd get and the one that I've been using is like by a small business called Inter Eve something like that and I've had it forever and it's literally about to run out probably had it a bit too long but unless I got as the zone, which was like 90p or something for a pack of two or three. Oh, it's 80p, I don't know. Or as the price, this was the cheapest. I can't remember how much it was. It was about a pound-ish. I've never used these before. I don't know if they're good. But that's what I got. Um, I got Bertoli because mine's super, super low. The dog just led down somewhere inconvenient. That's the missing one. So yesterday, like... There was no food in the fridge. I had two chicken breasts in the freezer that I froze because sometimes when I get Audi chicken breasts, they don't last till the day. So I froze them on Tuesday, Wednesday, Tuesday, can't remember. And then I forgot and then I had to defrost them in the air fryer on a low temperature. And I used my jar of chili con carne. So I made a chicken chili con carne, which was random. Put extra garlic granules in and extra chili powder in because when I tasted this, it wasn't hot enough but I don't like hot chilli like I wanted a medium one and then I put some frozen veg in and add it with skin on fries so it was something different but I basically replaced it. Tin of beans to replace the one that's been used so those three things are from Aldi then we're back to M not m and I haven't been to m and Asda, five hot dogs, I don't know how much they were I don't know if they're on offer of the full price because there was no price label on I did get the free for two drinks I got a Dr Pepper Zero which I've drank and I got a Monster Energy in a green can um, like a, a, almost a lime green colour I've never had it before but the Monster selection is getting less and less every week and also obviously got this cheddar and red onion hand cooked crisps chicken ramen I got this around where the Polish sec section is these were cheaper than the ones I got last week. The ones I got last week were really nice, so we'll see if these are any good. Cheese oat cakes, shaving gel, the other pack of sticks, the Misfits Nasher sticks, six milk chocolate rice cakes. I was actually lucky to get these because there was two packets left. Limes, pearl barley, which I've been looking for for weeks. It's in the rice section, but it never used to be in the rice section. So, I've not run out, but I'm getting low. Chopped tomatoes, I don't know what the brand is, but it was on offer. A fresh garlic bulb, 
this is what I use in my bathroom upstairs. I went back on to it like a month ago because I was using some else, the Aldi one, the ginger and something. Um, I had that a couple of times. I didn't realise how low mine was and then I think it was yesterday or the day before I suddenly noticed how low it was. Like it's literally down to about there. And I forgot about it and I was walking through this, this section, that's where I got the salt from. And I spotted this before the salt and I was like, oh yeah. I even forgot about the salt, so it's a good job I walked through that section. Lucas Aid Sport, last week I got those two four packs. Now last time I got the four pack, it was on offer for 250 and it's normally 350 What I didn't know is they've put it up to four pounds, which I think's a lot of money. So it actually cost me eight pounds last week and my voucher wouldn't work, so I've still got two or three of those, but I've got that now. Two sparkling apple and mango and I've got four again because there's still 125 and that's Aldi by the way and I got five apple and elderflower from Aldi now to the fridge see because I'm not editing it you're just going to get complete blackness unless I'm showing you something so I got two of them the other one's down there if it's in use it gets turned that way and I got free almond milk because as you can see I have run out. So I do have cereal and I do have my protein whey protein powder smoothies and I use my almond milk for that. So that's why I go through a lot of almond milk but I still have coconut milk left but sometimes I can go through too. Up here I got some beef, diced beef for the slow cooker, it's not for me. And chicken kievs because they seem to always want chicken kievs. Now those pizza slices haven't been in stock for a few weeks and neither have the fries but apparently they take stuff out of circulation to make room for Christmas stock although there's nothing in place of those two things so I don't know why they've took those particular products out of stock because I really like those fries. So the last two weeks I've had to get these pizzas, I mean it's not for me anyway but it's nowhere near as good. Then I got four of these, I got two peach and two strawberry and I got a kilogram of chicken breast. I got these fries, shake shake fries in smoked paprika for 2 50 but the Asda's own that I got the other week were horrible so this is kind of my only choice. I got a skinny latte because they're on offer for £1.25. There's the other protein pot, I also got some mild cheddar slices because there's been a couple of times where I've really wanted a cheese and onion sandwich and you know I don't really eat cheese but if I do eat cheese it's mild then I got this I had the gingerbread one a couple of times I think these are only 69p and even though I do like the gingerbread one I just fancied the caramel one I don't think I've had the caramel one before unless I have and I can't remember when I got that, I also got the Gut Health, Mango Gut Health. And a block of mature cheddar. Last week I got that more expensive cheddar. It's not been opened, but the cheaper cheddar gets used for like baked potatoes and other things. But they've still got the nicer cheese. I don't think there's anything else in the fridge I'm just quickly looking and moving stuff as I'm talking but I think that might be it for the fridge obviously I got my half a frozen bag of ice I mean the other half is defrosted oh I also got 24 bottles of water so it's two packs of 12 but they're both in my car I didn't get them out I don't need them I'll probably need them tomorrow but other than that I think I've shown everything, I'm pretty sure. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them down below. If you're new to my channel or you watch my videos but you're not subscribed, please subscribe and don't forget to press the notification button to get an alert when I upload next. I hope you all have an amazing day or rest of the week and thank you so much for watching.